What's up, Luchi gang? Welcome back to the channel. We are on a mission this morning. You want to tell them why, babe? Yeah, because somebody reached out to me on Instagram saying they need some help. And they was in Houston alone, basically. They're not from Houston. And their daughter got flown in from out of town to the Houston Medical Center because she might need a liver transplant. And they needed some help with, like, some groceries or some support yeah they just wanted to see if we could help out because they didn't know nobody here in houston and they knew we lived here and they watched our youtube channel and they're like let's hit them up see if they can help us out so we reaching back out to the lucci gang since we are the lucci gang ambassadors and that's what we do <laughs> you know what i'm saying god has blessed us to help others and that's what we're doing right so right now we are heading actually with the whole entire family. We have the baby, we have Gigi and Kingston and Leah are way in the back. Um, but we are heading to the medical center. But before we get to the hospital, we are gonna run into the grocery store. We're gonna try and get them some snacks, you know, things that they can basically munch on or like have it on hand throughout the week or however long they're gonna be at the hospital. And then we are gonna bring y'all with us. This is such a touching story because y'all, as y'all know, we have kids and I know a lot of y'all have kids as well. And this little girl is, I believe, 15 years old, but we'll give y'all more details when, once we're there. Um, make sure you hit the like button before the video gets started and also subscribe. Luchi gang, we are doing it for y'all. We love y'all so much. inside of CVS and the first thing I saw was some flowers and the reason why I am in here by myself is because the kids are in the car and we didn't want to get them all out so what we're gonna do is tag your it so I'm it right now I'm in here I'm about to grab some snacks a couple things that I think we should get them and then I'm gonna run back in the car and let Lucky come in and add to the things that I already picked so here we go uh never mind i turn around and i see that you one just start screaming okay so let's get to it so i think i'm gonna do a little uh something for her and we're gonna get some stuff to decorate her room what is this a new ginger oh and you can eat this king you're not eating it no weird. i know it's for her though but you can eat it right Oh, wait, wait, who's it for? Leah? Yeah. Oh, yeah, let me get a house. Leah, let me get a house. Why not? Give me a house. <laughs> I think you want like a different one. So we got flowers, we got cereal, we got a blankie, we got uh, Pringles. Some decorations. Thank you. Some chips. Okay, so Lights to decorate. Got her some shampoo and conditioner. Some socks. Candy for what? So we got three, three of these bags. Lucky still has one in there, but we're about to head over to the hospital right now. Say hi. Okay, so you want to tell them what the cashier was? <laughs> the lady at CVS. She was like, "Y'all acting like it's Walmart up in here." <laughs> She's like, y'all some junk food junkies, ain't y'all? She couldn't tell who was a drug dealer or a shopaholic. Okay. That's what she said. I don't know what's worse, a drug dealer or a shopaholic. Like, Dad, you think we some drug dealing shopaholics? She was either saying, comparing us to a drug dealer or a shopaholic. Because we had all this <laughs> stuff. And then she goes, oh, and then we, I told her it was for somebody at the hospital. And she goes... Oh, y'all don't be like them people, the man in the hospital for diabetes and... Y'all sneaking them in some sugar. Y'all sneaking them in some candy, some sugar. I was just like, oh my God. 
kept rambling on and on. I didn't understand half of the words. Me neither. That's because she was it. missing all the front teeth. <laughs> it was hard to understand what she was saying. But we are heading to the hospital, like I said. So we are literally down the street. I'm so excited to see her reaction. I can't wait to decorate her room, one. And two, give her all her little uh, gifts that we got her. I got her socks, a blankie, and, you know, little cute stuff here and there. Shampoo and conditioner. Um, and then I also got, we got a whole bunch of snacks, you guys, like a whole bunch. You ever been in this hospital? It's yeah. so pretty. I've came to a bunch of times to like visit people and stuff. I uh, love to stream. Six six five one, yeah. That's it. So, what's up? They got ballet. <laughs> I'm serious. <laughs> Bless you. No, I can't. Go. We don't even know if we're in the right spot. There's like bloody stuff right there. Family birth center is level nine. Yeah, we're in the wrong one. We're in the wrong building. This is for the women. So we literally were in the wrong building. The ballet at the wrong building. It's okay though. We're we can get that from here, right? Yeah, you just have to walk across. Instead of turning around, you gotta go left. Whoa. I know. Y'all on the wrong door. Okay. Where y'all going? Ninth floor. How beautiful is it? Yeah. Above. All right. So, quick update. I'm actually in the waiting room downstairs. Um, waiting on Lucky because they didn't allow all of us to go inside and um, basically the adults which is Lucky and myself could have gone to go see her in her room but none of our kids were able to go in so obviously we're gonna take turns he's in there right now he actually took her all her goodies and whenever he's done talking uh, to her and spending time with her and surprising her I'm gonna go in there and I am gonna try to tear her up and just show her all of my love and support um so just wanted to update y'all i hope that he vlogs if not i'll try my best to vlog and um i'll update y'all once we are back together him and i the kids are literally just sitting around they're kind of bummed out that they couldn't see her so that's why i'm just sitting here telling them that they need to be grateful because you never know and that they need to be nice to each other because they're always talking bad about each other and being mean to each other and they just don't realize how blessed they are that boy lucky luciano baby yeah, come, come, right? <laughs> come to show some love come to show some love I reached out to him this morning, he came through quick. Yeah, we got the blanket. We got a bunch of stuff. Me and my wife, downstairs with the kids. I didn't let her up with the kids, but she really picked out a whole bunch of stuff. So, update, Lucky came and said, tag, you're it. I'm next. We're walking into her room right now. This is her mom. So, huge shout out to her parents for her hitting us up. And just letting us know the situation. Where's she at? We gotta keep going. It's a little I'm so excited. <laughs> So we're about to decorate her room, and I'm so happy for her. <laughs> I appreciate y'all coming. You do? Yes. <laughs> no problem. She got a big smile on her face when he walked in. Aww. Oh, yeah, lost my hair. Aww. So she's awake right now? Yeah. Okay. Hi. I'm here with Soraya, and she literally just chugged her medicine because it was super, super nasty according to her. But she did it, and I just want everybody to go type down below in the comments and wish her to get better soon because we want her up out of here. She's actually nice to you. They didn't let me decorate her room, which is a bummer, and it sucks. <laughs> but you got this, right? Okay. So I'm about to head out because I bet the kids are downstairs acting a fool. But shout out to the mama bear and the brothers because they're here supporting their sister. So I'm gonna take a quick picture and then I'm about to head out.
I just want to say appreciate Lucky and Kelly coming through, showing my daughter some love. I hit him up this morning. He came through real quick. There's nothing but love, and, and we really appreciate y'all. Thank you guys so much. Y'all brought a big <laughs> smile to her face today. Y'all brought her hopes up today. Appreciate y'all. Thank you. <laughs> well, it's time for us to head out. Baby Houston's acting up. <laughs> Nino. Heading out. Hope you get better soon, Soraya. It's so sad to see all the people in ICU, you guys. So y'all make sure y'all count y'all's blessings. Y'all hug y'all's kids. Cause you just never know. Man, I felt bad seeing all those kids every time when I was walking up and down the hallway. Oh, there was a bunch of different kids, like patients in different rooms, but their doors are open so you can see up in there. And it was just a whole bunch of kids. It didn't matter if they was white, black, Mexican, Asian, no matter what race they were, it was all kind of kids, man, in there. So, y'all, you can't take y'all health for granted, man. Be thankful for your health.